It's a really important skill to be able to put numbers in order or to find the lowest and the highest number. So all we need to do is when we have two two digit numbers or two three digit numbers, it's the same thing, is look at the value of the very first digit. So in 56, the first digit is a five and in 34, the first digit is a three. Now five is greater than three. So therefore 56 is greater than 34. So 56, this is the highest number and 34, that is the lowest number. Here we have two three digit numbers. So again, we're just gonna compare the very first digit in both. So in five, five, six, the first, first digit is a five. In the second number, eight, three, four, the first digit is an eight. Or well, eight is greater than five. So therefore 834 is the highest number. And 556 is the lowest. So what's the highest and what's the lowest number of four, six, seven, and four, two, three? Well, let's compare the first digits. Now, the first digits are the same. They are both fours. So what we're gonna do now is look at the next digit along, which is a six and a two. So in four, six, seven, the second digit is a six. And in four, two, three, the second digit is a two. Which number is greater? Six is greater than two. So therefore 467 is greater than 423. So for this question, we are gonna order some numbers. Now notice, first of all, that all of them are three digit numbers apart from 97, which is a two digit number. A three digit number is always bigger than any two digit number. So 97, that is the smallest uh, value in this set. So 97 is our smallest. What we're gonna do now is to find the next smallest is let's look at the first digit of the remaining numbers. So all of these numbers contain three digits. So we're gonna contain compare the first digit of each of them. So we've got five, a five, and a four, and a four. So four is less than five. So the next smallest has to be either 462 or 415. Now, since both these numbers begin with a four, we now need to compare the next digit. So we're comparing a six and a one and we want the smallest of these two numbers. Well, one is less than six. So 415 is less than 462. So 415, then 462. Now we're comparing the two uh, weights which are in the 500s. Again, both these numbers begin with a five. So let's look at the next digit. We've got a two, we've got an eight. Two is less than eight, so therefore 525 is less than 583. So 525 grams comes next, and therefore 583 is the largest of these five weights.